Hello, in this video we are going to install the Ethereum client on Mac OS X and set it up for building using Go. If you want to check it out for Windows or Ubuntu, feel free, we've got separate videos covering that. So the first thing you want to do is go to your web browser and you want to download something called Homebrew for Mac. If you've already got it, fantastic. If you haven't, definitely recommend it and it's literally titled as the missing package manager for Mac OS and this basically allows you to install packages whether it's something like the Ethereum client to something like GFW, SFML, just a wide variety of stuff really really easily and builds it as well that's the fantastic part so to install it if you copy this line open up terminal paste this line into here and it'll ask you for your password. This is just the password that you use to log into your Mac. I've typed it in. It doesn't actually show it or even put a password character. So if you're typing your password in thinking there's no characters appearing, don't worry, it is actually typing it. Click enter and this will download and install Homebrew. If you haven't already installed Homebrew, it will most likely, I can guarantee that it will take longer for you to do it because you will have to download it and install all of the homebrew package manager for me it was very quick so now i'm just going to put clear so just clear the console it's just an optional step we're going to use homebrew to use it use the brew command i'm going to do tap let me zoom in the so brew tap ethereum for slash ethereum click enter and that'll be done in a few seconds. So brew tap, so the tap command essentially says, let us access the stuff within the Ethereum forward slash Ethereum section. And now we're actually going to install Ethereum. So click enter and I'll zoom out. And for me, it says 1.7.3 is already installed. If you haven't installed it, you'll go through a relatively lengthy of actually downloading it don't worry about that process because it will be done in no time so that's it honestly for installing the ethereum client on your mac using homebrew the last thing i'll say is download something called mist so if you google mist browser and you just go to the github page this will be the first link from here you want to go to releases and just select i would recommend the this missed one here because the other one is the wallet if you need the wallet great if not that's fine select either the dmg which is for mac or exe for example for windows install it and this basically allows you to run the ethereum client and test stuff out when you first run Mist, it will go through a process of downloading the blockchain. That might take a while. Just be patient. Once it's done, you can use the Mist browser. And you have the built-in wallet functionality as well, where you can you know, add your Ether. So that's it for setting up and installing the Ethereum client on a Mac operating system and you know allowing us to build it using Go. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out and as usual thank you for watching and i look forward to seeing you in the next video